Hello and welcome. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. I do daily tarot readings. Every day we ask the cards, what are our opportunities for today? This is going to be a reading for Thursday, March 3rd, 2022. Thursday, March 3rd. What are our opportunities for today? I do daily readings. If you like what you see here, please do like and subscribe. If you also hit the notification bell, you will not miss any of our exciting daily readings. Let's see what the cards have to say for Thursday, March 3rd, 2022. First card is the Fool. Fool wants us to take an adventure. Uh, this is something we're excited about. Uh, we're kind of acting out of uh, out of faith. Uh, we're not sure exactly where we're going, but we know we have faith. We're going in the correct direction. And we're not too worried about the uh, you know the downfalls here. We're just thinking about we're being very optimistic, using our faith, moving forward into this adventure. Uh, we have uh, packed up our stuff, so we're looking pretty good. Uh, we do have some mountains in the in the distance. That means it's not going to be the easiest trip, but we're very uh, we have faith that we're on the correct path, and we're very excited about where we're going. Next card is the Three of Cups. This is a cup about celebrating with friends and family and celebrating with your community, uh, celebrating your friendship with these people, making your friends know that they're very important to you. Uh, you know, share your bounty with them. Uh, go out and have some good, uh, have a good dinner, have a good lunch, have a good picnic. But make sure that your friends and family know how much you love them, how much they care, you care for them, and how important they are to you. Next card is the Seven of Rods. Seven of Rods is a card of defense. You're defending yourself at some point today. You're defending your, your rods or your thoughts and your passions. So you're going to have to defend yourself, defend your passions. It's going to look like a long-term defense that's going on. You're going to be victorious. But this guy doesn't seem to go away. He just keeps coming back and back. I think this is the third time in a third card, third day in a row we've had this card. So you're, you're in the defense mode all week so far. Uh, you're going to beat this guy eventually, but he's a nuisance and he keeps coming back. Uh, it's a long-standing battle, so stay strong. You have to defend yourself, defend your castle, but you're doing well, and you're going to succeed. Fourth card for the day, Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords indicates that your thoughts are keeping you up. You have a lot of thoughts going on. It's hard for you to sleep. Uh, none of these swords are actually touching you. There's no blood involved here. So uh, you know, sometimes we all get so busy in our own heads and with our own thoughts that it's just hard to hard to relax, hard to sleep. So we need to figure out what we're thinking about, figure out which of these, a lot of these thoughts, a lot of these things uh, can go away. Uh, a lot of these are made up in our own head. There's usually only one or two main thoughts that, uh, that are keeping us awake. The moon's out here. Let's use our intuition, see if we can figure out what's bothering us and get rid of some of these thoughts that are just made up problems that we've made up ourselves. Last card for the day is the Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups indicates you end up Wednesday feeling great. You feel very lucky. Uh, your cups are full. Your cups are your emotions and your love and your intuition. You're very happy with your family. You're very happy with your friends. You feel like you have a lot of love in your life, a lot of good emotions in your life. Celebrate this feeling. It doesn't happen every day, um, but when it does happen, just make sure that all your friends and family know how much you care about them and how important they are in your life. So, Thursday looks like a great day. You're off on an adventure. You feel very excited about this adventure. You have faith that you're on the right track and you're going to go to a good place. Uh, you're also celebrating friends and family. This goes along well with this Ten of Cups. These are both celebration cards. Let everyone know how much they mean to you, how much you love them, and how much their presence in your life fills your cups, fills your emotions, and fills your love. Uh, the more love you share, uh, the more comes back at you and the more the happier you feel. Uh, you do have, uh, there is some turmoil late in the middle, way through the day. You have to defend yourself, defend your emotions. And you have a lot of thoughts. Sometimes you, we get off track and start thinking bad things. And that can, one thought can build on another. Try to stay, can stay in control of your thoughts. Maintain, if you can think good things, get rid of those bad thoughts. Figure out the one or two thoughts that are driving all these main other thoughts. If you get rid of those or just concentrate on the thoughts that you can control. A lot of times the sores go away and you'll be able to get a good night's sleep. That's it for Thursday. I do daily readings. My name's Chuck. We'll see you tomorrow.